Shahid, welcome. Having to bowl first, does that affect your plans any? No, not at all. I think I'm very happy to bowl first and uh, I think uh, there is something in the wicket and uh, I think my bowler is capable to use this pitch. Oh, good pace, good bounce. There's a little bit of grass covering, well, a, a liberal. Bit of swing up in the air and got the breakthrough. Pakistan got the early breakthrough. Mohamed Amir is the man. Like the change of length, he'd been back of a length previously. Richards usually is very strong square of the wicket. And uh, the batting moves has start pretty early for the West Indies. You can tell that this guy has a few strokes. Andre Fletcher. They must have seen him. They must have seen the batting that up in the air. And yes, the second wicket gone straight to Imran Nazir, back for point. About in terms of length to Fletcher, yeah, it might have stood up a bit. But when you take away that full length where Andre Fletcher goes for seven, it's 11 for two. There's a big appeal, and yes, we got the third wicket. As the West Indies batsmen are a little bit naive in their stroke play, second ball, and you're looking to cut something that's a bit too close to you. 14 for three. This should be four. Short delivery. Good shot. One of the better shots we've seen this afternoon. Oh, that's gone. Second slip will take that catch, almost unplayable delivery there for Devon Smith, again the bounce. Got about to stand up on the link, and an easy catch for second slip. West Indies now 36 for 4. Good shot. Well, he's got another one of here, straight through Bernard this time. That is another beauty. Man not to be a man of the match here. He's changed his length absolutely superbly. 43 for 5. That's a good shot. About the conditions. That's uh, inside edge, I think, onto the pad. Is uh, quite outstanding. West Indies sinking now. Seam bowlers are on fire. That's full LBW appeal and he's gone. Fifth ball. Dan Seamus has been immaculate. On a hat trick, Nikita Miller. Full, four, off the mark. Good way to survive the hat trick. Well, I'm lost for words, Simon. That's a lovely shot. Over toss, but a very, very nice shot. It's gone like a rocket past the three to cover. Cleaned up. Beautiful bit of flight from Said Axmal. West Indies 85 for 8. Nice shot from Miller. Pierces the offside quite nicely. It is a Has uh, gone through from other boundaries. Certainly too full on this occasion. He's found the gap. Good shot. Oh, that uh, seems to be. A wicket there for Pakistan. Yes, Saijad Mal getting through the attacking stroke there of Tino Best for the West Indies. 121 for nine. He's gone straight up in the air. Enough bat on it. He has to sail over the advertising hoardings into the bags. And again, sensibly has picked up a single of the last ball to keep strike. And what's more, get his first 50 in one day cricket. Well played, Nick it up, Miller. Capitulate to 133 all out. Pakistan need 134 from 50 overs to take out their opening match in the Champions Trophy. So Cameron Akmal, very aggressive player, Imran Nazir. He's underway, Imran Nazir. Oh, that is a beauty. A little bit of a way swing. Imran Nazir looking to turn the ball into the leg side. So he's not going to improve on that uh, modest one day average. Pakistan side, five for one. Shah Malik. Cracking. That's big. Really big. Out of the ground, in fact. Oh, but look how quick uh, Malik's movement is into the offside. 
outside edge. And what a delivery that from Don. The plan should have been see off the new ball. Come run the pass for five. Pakistan 21 for two. Wonderful shot. Could be inside edge, right onto his thigh guard. No, the bat was nowhere near between the thigh guard and pad, and this hurts. He's guided that to second slip, who's dropped it. Very extra bound is the trick there. Outside off stump, playing away from the body. Simple catch towards second slip, missed it. And that's more with Yusuf's front foot cover drive that we were talking about. Shoot Malik gets going straight away. And what a quick outfield it is here. Nikita Miller dives in vain. Well executed. Again he's full and driven handsomely by Mohamed Yusuf. He's got him. He's pitched it up. Thick thin edge through to the keeper. Drew him into the shot full length. But what an evening he's having. Malik goes for 23, 54 for 3. Miss Balhak is the new batsman replacing Shoaib Malik. Oh, he slides leg side again, Tino Best. And there's still a glimmer of hope. Big appeal from behind the stumps. Mohamed Yusuf hasn't seen that finger go up. Pakistan now in a bit of a bother. 61 for 4. This is Omar Akman, age 8, 19. As Mohamed Yusuf departing. Let's have a look. Did he edge it or it was a thigh guard? Oh, it was nowhere near. That was nowhere near the ball. He's gone after it. He's played it on the offside. A oh, little outside edge there, and they've got the wicket they were desperately after the West Indies. Well, they learned from uh, the way the Pakistan team has bowled. And Pakistan are in some strife now. Shahid Afridi. Was it uh, your son? Oh, come from and a big appeal there, too. But a good decision. Oh, it's away through extra cover. It's a really good shot from young Umar Akmar. Wow, that's the shot. As we see there, two straight, two full. Gone down the ground quite effectively by Umar Akbar. Very good short ball, and that is cause, well, full toss, in fact. Look like he's in some serious pain at the moment, and it'll be a big blow for Pakistan. Slip Tina Best apologize straight away. Very good shot, very deft touch from Shahid Afridi. And that sums up Tino Best evening. The game's ended on a wide. The captain of Pakistan was there for the final run. Pakistan have won by five wickets here. 19 overs and three balls to spare. An emphatic win. They did have a little bit of a wobble in the middle of the innings.